We're out on the ice in northern Wisconsin and uh, chasing copies today. Um, one of the products I'd like to show you is called the Jaw Jacker. It's kind of a whole new system when it comes to tip down fishing. Instead of using a tip down, now you can use your rod and reel um, and actually fight the fish with a rod and reel, which is kind of nice. The Jaw Jacker is available at Raleigh and Helens. That's where I bought this one. It's got uh, teeth, little spikes that come out on the on the ends. That way when the fish hits and that's the fish is on, it can't pull the system down. The way that this sets up, it's got a pin that you pull off on the side. That's going to be able to adjust the, di the length out for the rod that you've got. If you've got a really long rod, you might need to go all the way out to number seven. If you've got a shorter rod, you know, bringing it back and forth to meet where your rod tip's going to come down into this holder. <clears throat> Once you got it figured out on where you want your rod to set, you're just going to slide this pin back through the hole. Right now I'll just set it on three. I'm not exactly sure what my rod's going to be. Uh, this is your rod holder. There's three different settings on this as well. If you really want it to go off hard, you set it up on the higher one that's going to tilt your rod back farther. That way, the rod tips down, it's going to put a lot more tension, so when it goes off, it's really going to set the hook. If you don't want it to set the hook as hard, you put it down on the first setting. That's what I'm going to do today, because I'm fishing crappies, and I don't want to tear it out of their mouth. And another thing you want to pay attention to, if you're using this thing for pike, you can get away with using a little bit heavier, stiffer rod. That's really going to hammer it to them when, when, it, when it goes off. And for crappies, you don't want to do that. they got a softer mouth. You want to use a little bit flimsier rod. That way, when the fish hits it and it takes off, that rod's just going to kind of come up and bend back down instead of just hitting them and ripping it out of their face. So that's the whole concept right here. It's That's the system set up. Now you've got a little loop that comes in the package. There's two loops. There's an orange one and there's a green one. There's two different two different loops. They're pretty much the same thing. What you're going to take, what you're going to do with this is you're going to take the loop you're going to go through the side of your eye. You've got the little angled pieces that come down on the tip of the rod. You're going to take the loop, go through the eye, go back through the loop, pull that tight. There you go. That's the piece that's going to be your hook setter. That's going to, that's going to go on the end of the jaw jacker. So now that I've got the loop that comes in the package on the tip of the eye of the rod. I'm going to set my rod and now this is where when I was talking to you about being able to move this to set it to the type of rod that you own. You've got a long rod versus a short rod. Right now this is going to be pretty stiff because it's got to come all the way out. So I'm going to go, I'm going to move this out one more notch. And it's pretty simple. This this is going to be your loop holder, the part that holds the loop on the end of your rod. This is going to hold the loop. You're going to drop that down, and this lever comes up, and there's your tension point right there. These two pieces are tensioned together. When you put your line through the loop, this little U piece on the end, when the fish hits this, it's going to set that off. Rod's going to go up and it's going to set the hook for you. Just kind of demonstrate. Just like that. Sets the hook, now the fight's on. So if you're sitting next to this jigging, you want to be able to have a, a secondary fishing pole or you're fishing for pike, if you're worried about losing the fish because of your drag. You do is set the drag so it's just a little bit just a little bit of tension on there so it can still set the hook but then if a pike takes off it can still go and it's just gonna zzz, 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 and it's gonna keep the tension on that fish till you get there, set the hook and fight the fish and bring it up. So give it a give it a try. It's a jaw jacker available at Raleigh and Helens. We're gonna try to get some copies on this thing today.